Hold your horses there, Mr. or Madam. I know many of you are just biting your nails, watching as your game downloads a while the clock of your work shift ticks ever so closer to its end. I know I am, but stay your hand, for I have a warning to tell you, and do like the video to help get others informed on this. One like gets the video out there to hundreds of more people. Look in the gameplay settings of your game and turn off the setting known as Karmic Dice. This setting is for those who want a dungeon master that would cheat their rolls. How it works is simple. If you get bad rolls, the game will force some rolls to be turned into good rolls. Yet, if you get some good rolls, the game will proceed to match them with bad rolls instead. This greatly harms the chance for your character to express themselves both by hindering the chances of them to show off what they specialize in, and at the same time, crippling any moments for them to show off their horrible faults and shortcomings. If you are new to Dungeons & Dragons, I will tell you that fudging rolls is certainly a matter of debate. Many do it, and many hate when it's done. I can tell you that I have always been the latter. How can you learn from mistakes? How can you triumph over evil when it's a hollow victory? I would go further in depth on this, but well, I want to play the game, of course. If you want to stay updated on everything Baldur's Gate 3 and get no spoilers, peruse my drinking menu to the right of me, and my latest video, oh, my uh, latest newsletter to the left. Make sure to subscribe to it in the middle. I hope you enjoy.